unbelievable time here at CES. This is just incredible. I mean, we're here at the Palazzo Hotel. I'm on the phone with John Woodman. I come pulling up to the hotel in a big car that says Lenovo on it. And I'm saying to him, you know, Coach, I know you haven't been to Las Vegas much lately because you're 99 years old, but come on. When you come here, you've got to be in this hotel. And then we come into this party, this restaurant at Lenovo, which happens in Incredible. It's just a phenomenal experience. The press conference this afternoon, it was right out of Tom Wolf and Sherman's voice. Like people elbowing, fighting, trying to get to the front there. It was remarkable. And Rory and Yuan Ching, they were up there talking about all the new products. You know, the phone, which is going to be unveiled in China in a couple of months. And then this, uh, the uh, Skylight, and then the hybrid one, which is just so spectacular. All the different things you can do. And I'm learning so much, and they're just ripping through it all. I'm saying, wow, how do I get to become part of this team? And I said, yeah, I'm with those guys. I'm with Lenovo. Let me ask you a question about Coach Wooden. Obviously, your your mentor. Um, what lessons did you learn from Coach Wooden that that might uh, be of use to people, for instance, who work at Lenovo in a team environment? I didn't learn from Coach Wooden how to use my Lenovo thing because at 99 he has refused to come into the 21st century. No email address. For no Coach email Wooden? address for the coach. Uh, no cell phone. No assistant. He's a, a, a one man operation. What a man. And what he has really taught us is the the great lessons of life that transcend that transcend any event because he teaches you the same thing that the noble stands for. He teaches you that intelligence, creativity, imagination, intuition, durability, reliability, all the things that are synonymous with the noble, that's what is going to get you to the top. It's, when it, it's what's going to keep you at the top. And so when I when I think of him as I do every day, you know, especially when times are tough, because when, you know, when you're hot, when you're on fire, and you're the king of the world. I mean, it's it's one thing. I mean, you just keep going. You say, "Give me the ball, get out of the way." But it's when times are tough that you really need not only the great wisdom, the experience, the past, the knowledge, and and the the vision how to get out, but that's also when you do the team work. And that's what the noble gives you, that's what John Wood gives you. And so here I am sitting at the point. How is this all going to play out in Las Vegas? Lots of hotel. I mean this incredible this incredible restaurant has been turned into a nightclub basically for Lenovo and all those customers and clients and we're just sitting here having the time of our life and I'm saying, oh my gosh, we've got to break this one out. So, CES 2010, this is where all the trains Miss this at your local barrel. If you're sitting at home saying, oh man, what am I doing? And you have failed to come to Lenovo and CES 2010, very nice. And we, again, we talked about your, your number one early life mentor, John Wooden. Uh, there, there was another major influence in your life, the Grateful Dead. What lessons did the Grateful Dead teach you that are applicable in an environment like Lenovo? The Grateful Dead, rock and roll, like the great basketball team, like the great computer company, Lenovo, it's, it's about the ability to deliver peak performance on the and to take a dead space, like a or a basketball that by itself does nothing, or a piece of hardware that by itself does nothing, but when you fill it with all the right equipment, you have the mind that's controlling it all. It really is like a team. It's a John Wooden, it's a Jerry Garcia, it's a Mickey Hartman of course you're driving that train, and it's the ability of a group to come together and to solve the unsolvable to come up with solutions to problems that people would just throw up their hands with otherwise. But now, with the great ingenuity behind the Lenovo team, you realize that anything is possible. And that when you, when you come up with these remarkable products, and, and, and just, what, 20 new products here for Lenovo at CES 2010, and you're asking yourself, man, how am I gonna use all this stuff? And then, ultimately, at the end of the day, comes Sunday night when they shut this down, we're all going to be saying, 
2011 can't come quick enough because we had so much fun here. We just want this to happen all year long, every single day. Lenovo rocks.